What's up, Eric? I will not be able to do Kopi's voice, uh, so it's going to sound really scuffed. You could do like, a super fine. deep Kopi voice. Yeah. Wait, hold on a second. <sighs> what are you talking? Oh, fuck. Well, man. Like, it's, it's good. It's good. It's like, yeah, yeah, bird, yeah. it's like you got a bird in your throat. That, that yeah, would yeah. be like, <laughs> for at you. the start of the session, Remo could like punch her in the trachea or something. Or right in the windpipe. Just, yeah, just keep what up. What do you think you're doing, Remo? Oh, that's... Oh, oh sorry. <laughs> That was me, dude. I'm telling you, I can, I know, I can fill in. Just type, type what you want me to say, Eric. Oh my god, Yeah, dude. Just use text to Sam. I feel I'm so good. Text text to Sam. I can't I'm believe I just do. Brett fell for that. That you, was hilarious. I fell for it. I fell for it hard, dude. I can't fucking believe it. Oh god, live on Twitch. Chat fell for it too, owned. Yeah, chat absolutely fell Don't for know, it. Don't know, Wald, huh? <laughs> Still not right? Okay. Nope. Bree, I Still not right. appreciate your... You're banned your... from Twitch. <laughs> they panned you. They, they panned you. They, they, they yeah, take Twitch their emotes and you the very seriously. Bree, you, didn't, um, you didn't make that joke while front page, right? At... <laughs> <laughs> I wish I Just... would have. <laughs> <laughs> you missed you would have gotten oh, got an answer. Yeah, you would have asked. I really wish I would have. <laughs> missed opportunity, indeed. Oh, oh my god. All right. Uh, be, uh, you'd be in the Hall of Fame alongside uh, OK yeah. Boomer Girl. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> she has Don't a name. Girl. Um, Does she? Who? Yeah, Who the fuck Nico. is OK Boomer Girl? Thank you, thank Didn't you. She, thank she you. signed with 100 Thieves all that. She's in the big leagues. Uh -huh. There's 100? What the fuck? Oh my god. Just... Why are there 100 of them? <laughs> <laughs> they got they're so, stuff. They're, they're also so publicly, publicly, publicly they're, they're so dude. well known publicly that they're just bad thieves at that point, right? Oh, like, yeah, yeah, they, right. like that goes against the mantra. Ooh, I'm let's a start a drama war right now <laughs> on D and D. Yeah. Hundred thieves, war. we're calling you out, all a hundred of you. That's right. <laughs> There's only six. Wait, hold on. Seven we of us. We take on like twelve. We should be fine. <laughs> all right. Yeah. yeah. I was about to say, like, you know, I could run for a hundred people. And then I was actually curious, what is the world record for biggest group in a D and D game? Like what? Uh, I'll, I'll tell off. you what, though, Brett. I'll tell you this for free. They didn't have a good time. Okay. No, nobody <laughs> did. Oh, I know. Hundred <laughs> player no session of D and D. Look, the world record isn't how many people did you run for and did they have a good time. It's literally. Just well, it should be. <laughs> I mean, yeah. Yeah. this world, world record records are more important than fun. Yeah. yeah. I'll, I'll I'll pay someone to say they had fun for a while. That was record. such a Benji thing to say. <laughs> What was the oh, Benji true, thing though. to say? World records are more important than fun. <laughs> well, it's, but it's true though. Guinness World Records, like you, you scroll through it, half of it's like how many fucking donuts someone ate until they vomited. You know, longest that, toenails. How is like when it's <laughs> yeah, like, how is longest up. toenails fun? Go on. <laughs> All right. Uh, let me. How am I gonna do this? I'm just gonna shrink that down, make that tiny, make that tiny. It's the first time I had this, so no, make it very tiny. I want, want the viewers to see what's going on on the on the board. Uh, okay. Oh, excuse me. Sorry. Oh my god. Did you How just dare you? spit at me? Did How you know? dare Did you? Dare just you? Shoot your venom my direction. Just, I rise from my me. chat. Listen. I look disgusted. <laughs> <laughs> there's there's one thing there's one thing I've learned running a bunch of D and D shows, uh, especially right before I'm about to get into it, and because I d I've done a lot of talking to like chat and I've talked to you guys, uh, it makes me very belchy like right in the beginning, and I hate it. Mm. So it's Just all... right at the start. You should lie down on your tummy. What? Okay. Yeah. Well, does that, that help with burpees? I don't think so. It seriously helps with. I pat myself kind of on the back guess. if like I can't baby. burp. Is yeah, that, that's what, yeah babies have. It's called burping. Yeah, Whoa. it happens when I'm singing sometimes and like, I'm just like, dang it. And I have to stop the song yeah, and start yeah, patting yeah. myself on the back. Yeah, no, wait, <laughs> uh, uh, wait, sorry. I wasn't I'm being glad. patronizing. It's called burping when you pat a baby's back. Yes. To help no, them. no, I think we know that, Benji. <laughs> well, you're not being so, so much Benji, you've actually come, come off more patronizing now because you've done that. No, 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 none of no, you no, are you understanding. Guys don't understand. Let me really it's break this down. It's called burping. When, 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 when air comes out of this. mouth, like that's like a burp. Oh my god. Uh, that is absolutely true, by the way. Yeah, you started more page patronizing by clarifying you weren't being patronizing. No, guys. Well, some people need to be patronized. No, I'm sorry. Let me clarify. Um, <laughs> it's called You're burping. incorrect, actually. Babies when you can't don't, pat when themselves I, on their backs. I'm sorry. Let me, let me talk to you. Babies. They have little dumpy arms. <laughs> when you don't have money, you're poor. 
Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Actual Benji quote. <laughs> Wait, is that, is you that can't say Benji You can't say actual Benji quote. I believe that. But I it's believe not that. actually a... Fuck you, Lit Brett. Lit literally. <laughs> Benji, okay, first of all, Benji, you've like lied oh. like 20 different times during the Temtem. Yeah, no, we all okay. lied during Temtem. We all <laughs> lied during... <laughs> everyone lied. I mean, everyone lied. I'm going to start everyone throwing my toys out of the cot, okay? I I'm going to say bust a nut. Bust oh my God. Benji lied, people died. Unhinged. Well, it's been over a minute. Oh, no, that is actually what happened. I did. We did black out because he kept lying. He kept saying. Dude, Benji kept lies saying things like, the dances. He kept saying oh, things like, "Okay, you can catch the Temtem now," and then he would throw a card, and I would, and then we both died. It was. Oh, but, he's such a but troll. But you're equally lying. You're beside me, lying to me as well. <laughs> you guys like, are lying In your perspective, together. I'm the bad one because I'm like not you. Y yes, that's yes. Gmart and I, you, G -Mart and I had a great time. Good, sir. G Mart and I had a great time. We caught plenty of Temtems. We were, we we didn't black out. How many times did we black out, G Mart? Never. Never. Yeah, that's right. Zero times. It was a. It I was think liars black don't out. Care. It's weird. <laughs> that's what I heard. <laughs> no, no, you don't understand. I'm not being patronizing. Liars black out. <laughs> that's what I'm trying to tell you. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right. Well, uh, my character has been assassinated, and no. uh, I'm gonna just become Howie. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Can I roll a death saving throw on Tonti? Yeah, yeah. Why? Oh feel like just, just want to. Feeling dying. Yeah, just feeling. Feel, that's how I feel. Feeling dying. <laughs> All right. Um, so, you guys ready to begin? Ready to get started? Yeah. Nodders? Yeah. Yeah. And then the yeah. belts pass. Wait, I just got to work sure. through the belts. <laughs> All right. So, um, it. last we left off, you guys are continuing on your journey over to the Mournful Keep. Uh, where you have learned uh, a lot of uh, Queen Morbid, the former, or actually the the once uh, queen of uh, a kingdom over in Feywonder. Um, a great tragedy fe uh, befell her and her husband, which is why the realm that they are currently in is just completely destroyed and racked and covered in snow. You've also learned um, that the Count, um, or the Cr Count Friar, uh, may have had dark influences to be able to create uh, realms uh, out of certain ingredients of things. And for this one was uh, the befelling of a king uh, with the, the wailing mournings of a queen, uh, which created the, this, sort of, this sort of synthetic veil of Frostfell. Uh, where there are actors that have been pulled into this veil, um, but also uh, there have been individuals that may have, I don't know, I don't remember what exactly was revealed, so I don't want to say anything, but uh, I'll just keep that. I'll keep that to myself. But uh, the necessary uh, thing is, though, that Frostfell is currently just sort of withering away. It's becoming undone, and it may be because the Count has been has been killed, who was the keeper of that veil. Um, this may free uh, people, but if the veil is destroyed with others inside, uh, there may be unattended consequences. Currently, it's unknown uh, what would happen uh, if uh, if the if the uh, queen were to fall at that point. Uh, it's also been uh, you've also been informed that the queen is essentially sealed away with mourning, um, and that she currently has is a part of an undead uh, vessel who is eternally mourning over uh, at the throne room. Uh, once you'll have to defeat her in combat before giving her the ring back, which will hopefully free her of her mourning. But again, uh, it is uncertain of the fate of Frostfell, which is currently unraveling even as we speak. You guys decided at the end of the last session uh, that you will be taking a long rest, which means you have returned over to the uh, to the Curios Keep, uh, where you are immediately greeted uh, by the one and only Moth. The area in the lobby seems to be a little bit more cleared up now. You actually see some of the uh, spider webs have started to be cleaned up. Uh, segments of wood and, and just like wreckage has been cleared up, but that's going to go ahead and take some time. Um, <clears throat> starting uh, there, you'll see kind of like Moth waddle up to you in his little in his little form over there, and he just kind of looks up, and he's just like, 
Oh, you guys are back. Uh, how can I serve you? And he'll kind of give a little bow to you guys. Where's the, uh, where's the bedrooms at? Oh, same as they've always been. And points over to the north. And you see Remo just slowly walk up. We've, um, we've just come for a bit of a rest, that's all. Oh, okay. Um, actually, this was a good time for you to, uh, come back. I, uh, well, I, I had a question for you all, since uh, technically we do not have a keeper, uh, here at the Curios Keep. Um, so, uh, I'm not so much good on doing things on my own, but rather more the, the command of, uh, uh, indi individuals who have some say, and, well, considering the fact that you all brutally slayed the last keeper, uh, I suppose I have an inquisition for you. Um, I, I wanted to, well, if that's okay with you guys, of course, uh, attempt to rebuild a room, but I wanted to see if you had if there was anything that you were particularly interested in for that room. Hmm. Something that may aid you in your journey as you journey across these veils. Something that may age us. What if age. the whole room was you just a your bed? Like the ground was just the bed, the whole thing. And it's really soft when you walk into it and you can go to sleep. I like that. Hmm. Gooby, how would that help us? On we already bed? have a bedroom. I mean, Not there's... a whole bedroom. That room that is a bed. <laughs> right. We could throw right. some pillows on the floor if you want, if that would help. Yeah. Well, I, I've got an idea. Yes? Maybe just a place where we could prepare food or something. I don't know. A kitchen. Oh, I suppose I could make a small uh, room for, for food for you guys. Yeah, that's something I can do. Um, I I do have a couple of blueprints here, if you would be interested. Oh, oh dear. Blueprints I, where? I, where do you have the blueprints? <laughs> where are these prints of blue? Hmm. It's uh right over here in the in the in the book. The blueprints. Oh, yes. Is that like the mournful queen's son? Excuse me, fellow. I I must study these tomes. Oh yeah, I got the cooking equipment. Equip equipment. Equipment. Yeah, I got it from... I forgot where. Um, oh. From a box or something, I think. I and suppose, rations. I suppose I could work on a kitchen for you guys. A small dining room, perhaps? Oh, that would be so <gasps> wonderful. We could have dining parties. It could be a really good time. Really bring some life in this gloomy keep. Um, Howie, as you begin to study the blueprints, um, there are... Checks notes, I believe four um, that pique your interest um, as parts of the book are slowly being translated by Moth. Um, mm. There okay. are uh, four rooms of blueprints and Moth is willing to build one of them uh, for you guys. So uh, let's go ahead and see. Um, so the four rooms are the following. Uh, you can have a smithy be forged. This room allows you to create weapons and armor and also allows you to upgrade them with traits. Uh, in addition, you can use this room to provide a curious buff uh, to, to uh, a party member, uh, each of you, uh, providing a magical oh. bonus to a weapon or armor uh, per party member. This lasts for 24 hours or until you complete a long rest. So, if you do choose the smithy, uh, you will be able to either sharpen your weapon, making it a plus one weapon, uh, polish a shield, making it a plus one shield, or bathe your weapon uh, in a fiery oil, uh, which will allow you to deal an extra 1d6 fire damage uh, once per turn when you successfully deal damage with this weapon. The effect expires at dawn. And then you can continue uh, to upgrade from there to get uh, further improvements if that is something that you're interested in. Uh, yes, this also does apply to the, um, the hand wraps uh, that uh, Remo has for the fiery effect. Oh, uh, damn. The, so good. your fist would be on fire, essentially. Uh, the second uh, blueprint that uh, may catch your eye is that of a, uh, of a lab. Uh, this room will allow you to create potions 
In addition, uh, you can use this room to create curious potions or poisons once per dawn, period. Uh, these potions become use unusable at dawn, which means they have a 24-hour shelf life before they expire. Um, by choosing this, you'll immediately get the upgrades to create either four curious, uh, curious potions of healing, uh, two curious uh, greater potions of healing, or create a curious poison. Uh, which allows you to coat your weapon uh, with this poison. A creature hit with the poison weapon must succeed at a DC 13 constitution saving throw or, be, or take 2d6 poison damage, which you can apply uh, once per turn. Uh, once you coat the weapon, it will retain its potency for one minute uh, before completely drying. Uh, this allows you to create two poisons with the lab, if that is what you decide. And further upgrades allow you to create even stronger potions and stuff that may assist you on your journey. Uh, the third room... Uh, that you can create is a workshop of sorts. Uh, this is one that you are most more familiar with, Howie. Uh, the room will allow you to create uh, temporary wondrous items known as tinker items, uh, which will break okay. which will break at dawn. Uh, you can only have uh, a number of items defined by the rank. Uh, so all of these items essentially link to your um, artificer <laughs> infusions, Howie. Uh, are they are they the specific ones? Uh, so they are not all of those. There are certain ones that only you can do, uh, but this will allow you to apply, um, uh, essentially make or uh, make uh, certain items uh, that other people oh. can use if you'd like. So um, yeah, the item, no. yeah, the items you can make with the workshop includes an arcane focus, which will give you a plus one bonus to spell attack rolls, um, and yep. then continue on with the items that you're familiar with: alchemy jug, bag of holding, cap of water breathing, mm -hmm. goggles of night, rope of climbing, sending stones, wand of magic detection, and wand of secrets. Uh, once Ooh. you upgrade this room to rank two, however, um, you will now be able to make three items per dawn uh, but more importantly your artificer infusions howie that have a level requirement of six becomes five allowing you access to them one level sooner okay so wait are the amount that i can craft with this room separate from my own personal collection correct. that i make correct oh jesus Christ. okay wow Correct. That's potentially really strong. Um, so uh, with the rank one workshop, you can make two items, two per day um, from the list. Right. And as mentioned before, there are some items that only you will, on will only be able to create um, as an artificer that you won't gain access to. Um, okay. And then finally, the fourth room, as you kind of look at it a little bit, maybe you'll like, kind of like look around just to see what the heck it is um is specifically a spa room or a hot springs room uh this implants a hot spring uh oh. into the room and depending you already on the got one of those and depending on the what do you mean you got one of those a hot spring yeah you're talking we about got one in Frostvale? Yeah. yeah we don't need another one the yeah, one. it's gonna be there <laughs> it's going away bro <laughs> yeah what? The, one, the one that's unraveling it's fading away street. yeah eh. So, def depending easy come, on easy go. <laughs> so depending on the water, uh, kind of like as I explained before a couple of sessions ago, um, you could take the water that you find in hot springs as you explore around the world, kind of take a little vial of it, uh, and place it uh, within the hot springs of this room. That hot springs transforms uh, into a hot springs that you find, uh, with each hot springs providing a different property. Uh, so this will allow you to essentially give you a, a place where you guys can rest your weary bones and give you guys uh, some some buffs for 24 hours but you can choose uh, at this point in time you could only choose one of these rooms so now I noticed uh, no kitchen uh, yes uh, kitchen <laughs> well, a, a, a kitchen no, uh, no thing we demanded from this little soot fuck a kitchen uh, will be provided to you guys at a later date mm. did you call him a soot fuck yep <laughs> I wish uh, I had more energy to be excited about the hot springs, but yay. <laughs> yay. yay. So, well, now we gotta give it to him. Well, I suggest we do the hot springs. <laughs> oh my we god. Said that. <laughs> He's really good at that. Holy shit. Um, so, uh, it is up to you guys. You can choose one of these rooms. Uh, what would you. Okay. Like? Well, I'm I not like biased, so I think the tinker. Oh, okay. Oh, but <laughs> I'm not. I'm not I'm picky. I'm, I'm <laughs> <laughs> um, um, I will all let you know that you uh, will have access to all these rooms eventually. Eventually, um, but it will. There, this one is going to be for free, but there will be a cost uh, mm. for future rooms. Don't we already have one of the the, the pages? Yeah. 
Uh, you do, and that's so. It. Can so, we do what too? Yeah, so that's what the um that that the page that you have is gonna give you yeah. the free room. Okay. Oh. Oh, okay. Sorry, I, I, I thought it was without cost, like without cost. Oh yeah, no page. worries, gotcha. no worries. Okay. Hmm. Oh, I'm well, sorry. Well, hold on, hold on. I'm uh I'm fucking up here. My apologies. Uh, so mm, this explain. room will be for free. Uh, the second room will cost pages. Uh, will cost a page and will cost votes. Okay. 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 So we can do two technically now if we spend the most yes, of the can. page and also get the free one. Cool. Yes, you can. Sorry hey, gang. We don't yep. have to choose between the hot springs and the tinkering room. No, but I, I don't think I want the armory. I'm going to play devil's advocate. The tinkering room is useless until you're at least level five. I'm uh, going to play a uh, regular four, advocate. I don't want a fucking workshop just to spite him. What, what, what the oh. fuck? Oh. I don't workshop. Oh, so it comes out now. Petty. <laughs> <laughs> so, so to be clear though, th that's a lot of items I can make for you guys. What does that mean? Me. So like magical items, bags of holding. You can even have things that increase your damage, like fun Wait, shit. You can make lots bags of, of holding. The the I workshop. Can make lots of stuff. The workshop does not give you access to that for the two extra projects that you can do. It's specifically only for the magic item mimicry and creation. Which is which goes back to what I said. There will only be Wait. things that you can do. Sorry, yeah, I, I, I guess I'm getting looped on it. The things you listed, though, are the things I'm referring to. Yes, correct. And I will copy yeah. and paste that down if that will. Oh, sorry. My po my point is that I my, my personal ones that I can do myself outside of the workshop. Ah. I can give those also to allies, and then I can use the ones from the workshop for myself correct. or for a bag mm. of holding. Yeah. Correct. Mm. Correct. Correct. Yeah, I can make some pretty helpful stuff for the team. This is what it. This is what you'll be able to make with a uh, rank one uh, workshop. Hold on one second, please. Uh, I'm also open. Moth to will say this. We'll course. spew all this out. Perfect. Uh, yes, I, I interpreted all of that instantaneously. <gasps> he even said the secrets? semicolon. Mm -hmm. Oh, are uh, you what's a what? A wand of a secrets. A wand of secrets. Yeah. It's a uh, secret. secret. He oh. can't tell you. Yeah. I wish I could what tell you. What makes it so interesting? <gasps> Do you know what it is, Bree? I guess it's the secret it gets to you. It basically oh. just lets you figure out, like, it, it's kind of like of water discovering breathing. traps and shit, I think. Oh, damn. Rope of climbing? Kind what is of it? Nice, though. Here, I'll help you. Oh my gosh, wow. <laughs> Moth is a little encyclopedia. Yeah. A rope okay. of climbing, isn't that just a rope? I've no, it's a special <laughs> rope. You motherfucker! Fuck! Like, oh, uh, yes, this is my fork of eating. Oh, oh my yeah, okay. god, that got me. Holy shit. <laughs> I remember right. climbing like is, uh, 3, pounds. This is my cup of drinking. Like, okay, it's 60 great. foot. And you can also command it to, like, retract and animate. Oh, the uh, rope of climbing. Let me tell you about this. <laughs> 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 uh, <laughs> what? Uh oh. Thanks, Ma. You don't, you don't have to throw it. Basically, you, know, you can tell it to go to the other end of where you want it to be. So, like, it's like yeah, snake it'll, charmer it'll, out of a yeah, car. Yeah, and it will like... float over there like a snake charm uh -huh. snake, and then you can climb it. Oh, wow. yeah. it can useful. hold up to three thousand pounds. Whoa. Yeah, it can hold all of you. Well, all of actually weighs four thousand pounds. Oh shit! Uh, you're, you're so dense. <laughs> <She's very> dense. <laughs> How do you move? If she, like she over, she, if she trips over, she if all trips over, she instantly dies. She's so dead. <laughs> we all die. She, she just keeps falling through the world because of yeah. the, the the giant hole. Yeah, straight into the back rooms. Um, um yeah, I don't think any of us opens. need the uh, other two rooms, right? I think we're good with our spawn workshop. Yeah. Um, we could do that. Uh, I mean, smithing room is obviously very useful, but but none of us uh, are like do, do have outside weapons? of like buffing ourselves. Uh, I think my stuff's already plus one. Yeah, didn't I, we I just, got didn't we two. just like uh, send a smith here? Mm, he didn't make it. What? He might, have made it, he might be at the front door, like not. I mean, he's not here, so clearly Which, uh, he hasn't what, made it. What, what smith did you send? Did he die? The, the, the NPC the that we guy? sent. He had, what, what, what was, was his? Cap? He had a he had a profession, Brett. What was it? Are, are you are you talking about the the, the vagabond Cap, over Cap, the... Right. Yeah, yeah, the vagabond. Yeah. What's yeah, his name? Cap? You, you, you told him to wait. You told him to wait at the gate until you guys were up. He's still waiting. Yeah. He's probably dead. We could go get him during this long rest. 
Yeah, Hold on, is he even a sni- I thought he was just a dude. Okay. Yeah, I don't remember him well, being a black He can learn on the job, he's an intern. Okay. We invited him, we invited him to come and live in the keep. Yeah. Yeah, 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 but does he do anything? Yeah, I don't remember him doing like anything. People, people don't live in the keep for free, okay? <laughs> yeah. There's a cost. I mean, we're, oh. I mean, we're putting him to work. I mean, I, I mean, the rooms that we build in the keep are especially potent tools. I can always show people that you invite in here if you would like them to be welcomed guests on how to do uh, certain jobs, if that's what you'd like. So you're saying that the interns don't need three years experience? Oh, I'm, I'm not saying that at all. I just will provide the tools. It'll be up to them okay. to see if they can learn it. Well, we have somebody that could possibly work in the Smith. I personally, uh, personally like the, the idea of a workshop. But I, I'm open to suggestions, gang. If it, if it looks at Kopi, the spring, the hot spring. I do love a hot spring. <laughs> yes. So fucking good. <laughs> Kopi's like visibly shaking at the idea that like we could deny the hot spring. <laughs> yeah. Well, uh, Moth, what could the hot spring do for us? Uh, is it gonna help us at all? Or? Oh, I already know this. It buffs us. Yeah. Oh, well, how he doesn't. well, I mean, if you rest in the hot springs, it'll uh, ease your muscles a little bit, uh, provide you with a much more beneficial uh, right. rest of a short time than just kind so you of mean relaxing. Like doing the it chronic own. pain that I go through every waking moment uh, will be lessened? Uh, less of that? Ab absolutely. Uh, from my understandings of hot springs, especially from all the, all the worlds that uh, the previous... Uh, keeper of the keep would explore. Um, they all provide different properties. I suppose you could always bring a vial of, of, of hot spring water, depending on where you go, and I, I could use that to, to manifest the uh, the hot springs to share the, those qualities. Old! I want the hot springs! <laughs> okay, we could go ahead and work on that. Uh, is there what? anything else? What about the hot springs that we found? <laughs> Well, uh, uh, I'm, I'm uncertain of that hot spring. What do you mean? I want that one. Well, it says here in the book that we can bring the water back. Oh. Yeah. You also already have a vial of that hot spring water. That's oh, right. Yeah. We could transplant the water here, Kopi, and, and kind of create a, uh, a, a hot springs at home. I mean... Uh, well, since it's going to be a room, it'll be more of a catered room, so that way the water doesn't soak through all the wood. Uh, but I suppose we can turn the outside garden area, uh, if we ever manage to clear the boulder, and you kind of look up to the north where it's still caved in. Oh, Rad. You, you think you could do it, Remo? What, clear that? Clear, clear a bit of rock? No. <laughs> yeah, I don't think Who's so. Think I I am. <laughs> you don't think you're strong enough, lad? Oh my God. I'm not particularly strong. Oh, that's going to take a, no, a bit not, of I'm honest, eh? You've got big old arms. Strong legs. Give it a good kick. <laughs> I really don't think I want to. I don't want to disappoint old Howie, you do. Oh, oh you're peer pressuring me. <laughs> and it's working. <laughs> good, good, my child. It, it, Moth just whispers over at uh, at Howie. I don't think that's gonna work. I think he's gonna really hurt himself. I give it a nice solid kick. Yeah, your foot is, is stubbed oh. like immediately, as if you just like kick the side of a wall, and you'll just kind of see like Moth will be like, "All right, I think I should probably set up that hot spring now." It's so is foot. he dead? <laughs> I mean, have you ever hurt your foot? Step and toe? No, I, I don't have feet. I have <laughs> talons. I've done that. Oh, yeah. oh, oh, boy. Olive, this one's on you. It's always on me. Wait, what are you? <laughs> oh, gosh, please don't kick the rock. <laughs> She's going to examine his foot. How oh. bad is it? <laughs> Oh, it's uh, shattered, he, isn't it? I'll oh, never he's, walk again. He, he's fine. He's lightly bruised. He can apply pressure and everything. It just hurts like a mother right now. You might not ever walk again. Oh, no. I should have stopped him from kicking that rock. Yes, well, yeah. we all make mistakes. Shame. 
This is such a shame. Anyway, this book. <laughs> oh, somebody give me to bed. I'm dying. Yes, the hmm. only answer is we all must sleep now. You'll see uh, Moth look down to himself. He was going to start crying. Yeah, and, he, and he's just <laughs> That's like, a real oh. tiz. I, I remember when my brother stubbed his toe. It wasn't good. He was in pain for, for, Wait. for weeks. Do you have toes? Hmm? Do you have... Can you explain what moth looked... I thought it was like a gas cloud. Yeah, it is a little gas... Yeah, it is a little gas cloud. <laughs> That's not well, have toes. <laughs> did, know of. Your brother, did, did they... Were they like you? What? Um, moth, your brother, did, did they look like you? Brother? I don't have a brother. But you just said my brother stubbed his toes. I... I did? Yes. Why did I say that? He I don't down. know. He'll look down at the floor a little bit. He looks over. He says, I... Uh, oh, I'm sorry, Mr. Howie. I... Uh, like deja vu or, or something like that. I, I don't mm. recall having a brother. Uh, I'm sorry. Right, but about the toes. Mm. Yeah, um, mine's killing me. <laughs> <laughs> Hmm. I mean, I got this little one, and then he just kind of like he just like shakes his little his little foot leg is the best way to describe it. Just his like a tiny string, like, yeah. little like like a like a little nodule. Yeah, it kind of looks like a string of a, a, a string of yarn. Huh. Oh, oh my god, cute! It, it kind of oh, it, it kind of waves around in the head, uh, right in the, in the like the wind a little bit. <laughs> very, very adorable. Um. Oh, thank you. But I, I really like to. You said we could craft with modes of creation, and the page we found, we found a page or something. Oh, 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 yeah, 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 yeah. So, so you wanted the hot springs first, is that correct? One hot springs, please, of course. I feel like Kopi really needs it right now. Oh, okay, all right. Well, uh, I really need it. Well, uh, follow me then, because you're gonna need to pick out a room. Of there, you're gonna want. The you hot don't spring. even know. <laughs> I'm right. I think I know a little bit. <laughs> Anyways, this way. All right. Tokopi, do you want to choose the room for the hot springs? I feel like that's on you. Oh, it doesn't matter where. <laughs> okay. Oh. oh, I think your Fuck, friend man. desperately needs this a hot sucks. spring. It does suck. Sorry. Let me know if you want me to role play okay. at you less. <laughs> I feel bad sometimes. Like <laughs> I, I don't know. know. <sighs> Drag them out. By the way, specifically, Kopi, yeah, Kopi. monologue now. <laughs> what is it you were saying earlier? Tell me a story. Um, so, oh my God. <laughs> anyways, um, Where are you from? So all these areas in the, in the hallway are, are, are pretty much empty. Um, but with the page that you found, uh, I can go ahead and, and, and transform them. Or actually, no, I have a page. I'll go ahead and transform them. I keep mixing this up. Haha, <laughs> my brain. Anyways. That's yeah. okay. You're clearly very forgetful. Uh, Moth. That's my name, I think. Anyways. Uh, I feel point? like you nearly forgot his name there. Ah. Uh, got something to say, Tontu, from the other room? <laughs> I have I have advantage on all oh, hearing perception what? checks. <laughs> got this so, big ears, yeah. Oh so my I, goodness. I, I believe these four rooms over here are available. Oh, also the door that's by the uh, the fireplace. That's also available too. Um, which one are? Because I want it outside. In? Oh yeah. Um. Well. Uh. The only place that I could do that outside is if we clear the boulder. And I. Well. We're in. Then I don't want room. it in a room. Well, could we oh. move it at a later time? <sighs> I mean, it's slightly no, inconvenient. I don't but... want it. Oh. oh. <laughs> Moth looks down, oh. <laughs> feeling that he broke your heart. Oh, Moth, it took okay. You did break my heart, even though I'm not supposed to hear your voice uh, in your head. <laughs> uh. What the hell? He panics a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> Look, I... if we can't do it outside, I won't want it. I'm going back. Moth looks like he's about to break down to tears. I'm Moth. Just... Moth, it's okay. I'm just trying to be helpful. Kopi's not one for um, compromise. Right. No. But, but wait. 
you were saying that maybe you could potentially move it. I, I, I feel like I heard you alluding to that. Oh, uh, yeah, I, uh, I guess I can. You see Moth's kind of getting into a little bit of a panic now. I, I suppose we could move um, the boulder. It's just going to take a lot of... Oh, no, 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 you're misunderstanding, Mr. Howie. We're saying, could you place the hot spring here? And then when we move the boulder later Toby on... will scream across the hall. No, I don't want it like that. If we can't well, put it outside, I don't want it. We want it like that, Kopi. Hmm? She storms off. Moth looks down, heartbroken. Guys, I don't think Kopi likes me and I'm just trying my best. Oh. No, I don't think she does either. Um, I, no, I, I guess I have to accept it, but do the best that yes, I can. We, we all must team. accept things sometimes. Well, maybe um, Kopi will warrant me that uh, you clearly have. Looks up to Howie. Yeah. Anyway, um. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. Jesus. So oh you were set. <laughs> moving the uh, moving the hot springs at a later date. That that's possible. It is, but if, if, if Kopi doesn't want the, the room, then maybe we should just wait on that. Well, maybe we can talk to Kopi privately and figure out why mm. they're so against having it in a room. And then we can decide. But for now, Mr. Howie, we could do your workshop. Oh, yeah, I'm down. <laughs> Moth, Moth looks up to you. Oh, yeah. you guys being hip. <laughs> <laughs> it's yeah, totally down. cool. Oh Wait, what's that, Olive? <laughs> Which uh, Ponty rubs his little hands together know, and gets like warm at the like fire. This sometimes. Um, you know, I really don't mind, Moth. We could just chuck it in any any old room. I don't mind. Oh, oh you have as long to as it's in the most efficient place in the entire building. Oh, you, I'm afraid you'll have to pick. I, I would feel too bad if I chose the wrong room. Yes, that would be bad if you did that. <gasps> Mr. Um, Howie, stop it. <laughs> what? Uh, Moth's eyes water up. What's this, Moth? A great a great choice, a great, a fine suggestion. This this room right here. Oh, yeah, we could do that. Um, I believe this room was once upon a time the former dining room. We can absolutely transform this into, uh, ah. into a lovely workshop for you if you'd like. And we what will dine, dine on my room? artificer creations. But a workshop Open. of the mouth. <laughs> hey, hated that. Uh, okay, so. <laughs> what, what? Wait, what? Huh? <laughs> All right, I suppose I could work on this. Um, tell me, how do you imagine your workshop? Oh my gosh, do I do I get to choose the uh, upholstery? I, I suppose I I would like it to. I would like to make it a little. Um, uh, um, homey for you. Uh, what's your favorite oh. color? Uh, um, gosh, haven't thought about that one. I like reds, browns, beige, you know? Okay. I can Colors I that don't really say anything. I could definitely work with that. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, but so what so I'd really like, I'd like the anvil up high. I want a perch. Okay. I want, I want my work to be done looking down upon the rest of the room. So like a like a like a stick of some kind, because you're you know, and a platform for the anvil. Okay. And a table. Yeah. On the a wall. You're you're interested in a tableau? No, a, t a table. Yes, a tableau. Why Olive, what what's he doing? Like I'm not sure. Um, moth, where you come from? Is that how they say table? Like the thing with four legs, and you put stuff on it. I don't know. And do you have a brother? <laughs> Moth just looks just layer that on thick. <laughs> just by the way, extremely like extremely concerned. It's like I don't know. It's Why okay. Did I say well, that. It's okay. Hey, I don't remember anything about who I am or where I'm from. Yes. Okay. And I'm doing great. So you would like a, 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 a uh, <laughs> so you would like right. a perch? Is that cur hello? <laughs> just watch yeah. QB. Oh yeah, all right. Sorry. I'm just watching QB. <laughs> uh. I'm bored. I are we gonna do something soon? No. 
<laughs> I think we're going to bed. Kid bored at store while parents are shopping. <laughs> I, uh, it's we'll bedtime, QB. Store later. <laughs> Oof. <laughs> hoof, audibly hoofs. <laughs> so would you would you like a branch of some kind that you could per per perch on? Yes, like a perching branch with an anvil and a platform and a table halfway up the wall. Uh, lots of red reds, beiges, browns. Um, I want a roaring fire, Moth. Jot this down. You're not jotting. Oh, okay. So like a like a furnace of some kind, or yeah, like it's a big campfire? furnace with a bellows that requires, I don't know, some kind of heavy counterweight to be attached to it. Because I'm not heavy enough. You understand, Moth? Oh boy. Okay, uh, that's gonna be a really condensed room. Are you are you sure about all that? All oh, oh, I'm not done. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, so I need a, um, I need a big, large, expansive, tool selection. Uh, racket. I want to be able to put everything in a different specific place. I want it to look aesthetic, though, Moth. Okay. I okay. want it to look professional. I've never had a professional workshop. Uh, well, I, I suppose we could do something like that. Uh, I'll probably put some stone down over there, so that way the room doesn't catch on fire. I mean, unless you want the room on fire. Oh. Yeah, I suppose I can make the room on fire, if that's what you I'll want. I'll leave that to you. <laughs> I don't... Uh. Uh, uh, um, I don't know if we should make the room on fire. That does that doesn't seem to be very very. Mm -hmm. It's a great idea, one. Moth. Thank you for your for your help. He's gonna wearily like start waddling away. Moth, between you and me, I don't think he's gonna remember half of the things he just told you. So don't feel too bad if you don't get it all. Oh, I understand. Uh, but still, I I still want to do good for 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 the uh for Mr. Howie, you know. Mm-hmm. You'll do fine. You don't put too much pressure on yourself. Uh, everyone's kind of bossing you around. Uh, I hope you're okay. Oh, I'm. Oh, I'm fine. I mean, this is I, from from my my basic memory. Uh, the count was far worse. Uh, so you know, I'm 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 doing fine. Thank you for okay. checking up on me, though. Mm-hmm. Uh, well, uh, is there anything else I could do for you, uh, Miss Olive? Oh no. Uh Kiwi, let's go. Uh, oh. Kiwi <laughs> fell asleep on the table. <laughs> okay. Goodbye, Mr. Smoke. Okay. <laughs> Bye, tiny child. <laughs> Goodbye, tiny oh. child. I mean, that's fair. <laughs> Lol. <laughs> Uh, what happened? Tonto is curled up asleep in front of the fire. He's using his shield as a pillow. I forgot Moth wasn't illuminated, so I was like, he just only got dark. Black, I was like, yeah. in the dark. I was like, where did he go? My boy! He's gone. My, my boy. <laughs> Moth will waddle up and say, all right. Well, if you want to go ahead and get some rest, um, I will begin work on this. And when you are fully rested in the morning, You'll have a beautiful workshop, ready to go. We didn't use our inspiration buffs. Is there anything fun we can just roll randomly on to use our inspiration before we lose it? <laughs> oh yeah, uh, you should We can play truth or dare. <laughs> you, should, you, should, you should hide behind that statue. I'm sure that would be really impressive. <sighs> hide behind the statue? Yes. Oh. Uh. <laughs> Go ahead, roll a <laughs> stealth check at advantage. Oh my god. Well, I don't understand. Okay, I'll do it though. Uh, stealth. Whoa, what? where'd you go? <laughs> what? Moth points over Does at you. Does that have an advantage? Oh. <laughs> I guess I'm not stealth. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Our passive what? perception is higher oh, than that. Oh, where'd she go? Oh no, she's gone. <laughs> Howie uh, insight check on Moth to see if he's lying. <laughs> right, am I allowed to do that? Yeah, absolutely. Okay. Through his suit covered teeth. Oh no, where'd you go? Oh no. <laughs> I knew I couldn't trust him. Oh no. Mr. Harvey, he's doing his best. Are we he's playing hide and seek? Too kind. 
as you say as you're like standing there. <laughs> well, I suppose I should start get, getting back to work on this. Can Good night, sleep, Moth. I'll sleep here in this fountain thing. I'll just curl up and make a ball and go to sleep. What is wrong with you guys? We have beds. <laughs> If my room is not a giant bed, nor I'm not interested. One singular mattress for the floor. One singular mattress. Or if my hot springs is mean, not outside, this keep is useless. <laughs> we, we're very picky adventurers, okay? Hunter is asleep on the floor by the fire using the shield as a pillar. Oh. We are not I'm the same. A, I'm not going to make anywhere. it. It's bad. Oh, uh, Remo. There's a bench. I'm just up leaned there. up against the wall. <laughs> Nobody dies from a stubbed toe. Well, yeah, right. unless you stub was... your toe on a knife, then you could die. I what, was pranking you? you. What? It's just a little little thing, a little trickster moment. I don't know, something came over me. I'm gonna be okay. Yeah. You know what? It's not actually that bad to stand on. I, I think I'm good. Yeah, you were maybe being a little bit dramatic. Takes one step, immediately I, flops. I thought you all just said, yeah, you're kind of being a little bitch about it. That, that's what I thought you said. Yeah, basically. Was basically. Like, I was right. like, she said that, just, but like with, with, with her PR voice. Yeah, 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 yeah exactly. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, holy shit. Her telephone voice. Yeah. <laughs> I think you're being a little dramatic. <laughs> all right. Um, it's the bedroom. Howie would just walk, follow Rimu. Are you, yeah, is that the bedroom, Brett? Locked. Or is it up? Oh, it's Door's north. stuck. Okay. I think it's this one, Greg. I'm going to crawl down the hallway. Still crawling. Still crawling. I took a step, didn't, wasn't feeling it. Crawls into the bed, bro. <laughs> I suppose at some point in time, I should redo the bedroom. Oh, dear. Oh, guilt, bother. guilt, guilt. <laughs> oh, bother. Now, now, Remo, it's time for bed. What are you, my dad? Let me just lecture you on the placebo effect while you <laughs> close your eyes. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> so, sometimes when... <laughs> and he goes on to... I assume Remo would probably fall asleep about half a second into that, yeah. <laughs> just a second. I'm just squinting at you from my bed like, what are you <laughs> saying? <laughs> <laughs> Is everyone completing gonna be completing a long rest? Yeah. 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 Uh, yeah. Yas, please. Right. Yas, uh, I had a question about my frozen Yeezys that I've been carrying on my belt <laughs> and haven't identified yet. Yes. Uh, we do that during the long rest. Uh, yeah. Oh, so we... this 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 all is considered a short rest. Uh, you are able to identify it without needing to cast a spell. So, uh, if you, I will roll, I will roll. I will you roll do it? You. Okay, you're roll. gonna. These are weighted well, dice, but hit I will. It. I will roll a one d twenty. Yay! So, if he rolls bad, he's, he's still yeah, it. it's, it's here. Ball. We go. That's oh, that's pretty, pretty good. good. Could have uh, been better. You found uh, exquisite boots. Uh, these exquisite boots have a market value of two hundred and fifty credits and can be used when making boots uh, as a leatherworking material. Uh, if you ever decide to go into leatherworking. Or you could so, convert them uh, into half its market value into modes of creation, uh, which in which case your mode of creation amount will go up by 125. Or you can attempt to sell it. Um, well, uh, I cannot someone. wear them. I mean, you could wear them. Are they don't... a component? Or you they... could wear them, but they would have no statistical They would have no okay. effect, correct. Um, They're they just are, boots. They are a material component uh, if you ever decide to craft boots, if you ever get into okay. the working. Okay. Or if you ever build a room specifically focused on the working, uh, then yes, you'd be able to do that as well. Also, I noticed in my equipment, I still have splint armor. Is that the guard's armor? Yes, it is. I'm just going to delete that. Okay. I don't want to carry that around. It was 60 pounds. Okay. Uh, so this will be exquisite boots. Uh, it will have a marked value of 250 credits. And then... Uh, that will be that. I'm trying to see if there's a strike through command. I don't think there is. So I'll just delete that. Boom. Done. 
Uh, the, uh, yep. Okay. Sounds good. All right. Uh, so I will be giving everyone the long rest now. Please hold. You are now long resting. It is a good rest because you have gotten the long rest benefit. I keep forgetting Kopi has 64 hit points. Like, it's ridiculous, right? That's insane. All right. Log rest. Log rest. And log rest. Uh, your inspiration uh, for this day has been removed because uh, you have completed a long rest. If you don't use it, you lose it. Wait, do you get inspiration, Brett? What? <laughs> because normally you give out birthday inspiration, but it was your birthday. Oh, I don't do cheat I, against us at one I point. Don't, I, I don't do birthday inspiration. He uses his oh. birthday inspiration to kill us. He's a hater. <laughs> <laughs> yes. In fact, uh, when it's your birthday, I give you uh, demotivated inspiration because you're getting older. Your body's withering away. And so you should deserve the extra challenge. I don't do that either. So sorry. My lip was quivering while you said that. In, in fear. <laughs> we could hear. We could hear your lip quivering. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Heard... You have um, what we call in the business loose lip. Yeah. Oh my god. That, that's not it quite what just... that means. That's oh. not exactly what that Yikes. means. Sam. Good Are morning, sure? everyone, or good afternoon. I want you to think about that. <laughs> I am happy to report that I have completed your workshop. It's too early. Oh, sorry. My workshop. He flies over. Oh my my workshop. I'm fixed. My well, could you I take care of the, the rock that's because over there then? I, I, I mean, I'll, I'll good work. Good morning, everybody. Morning, Tonto. Mor Wait, where is... Uh, QB? Huh? Oh. QB, like, unfurls her wings and kind of... Jumps on the top of the fountain. I'm here. Oh, He's oh. oh yes. Is it morning? It is morning, indeed. It's 5 a.m. Oh, Where's uh, Miss Kopi, I was, uh, I was thinking about that, um, for you. Um, I, I believe I can clear the rock. However, it will be a, uh, quite an exhaustive amount of resources, uh, with your modes of creation. Uh, specifically, I think I'm going to need a thousand of them. How much do we have? <laughs> 150. Pay, pay the man. Give me the money. Put the money in the basket. Put the money in the bag. Put, put the money in the bag. How much do we have? How many modes uh, are you have much, how much do you? I don't think it's worth it. Oh, I mean. Wait, how much does it I'm, cost? Well, uh, to clear out the rock, it will cost 1,000 modes of creation. We don't know what else that's going to reveal to us, gang. two thirds of our capital. Yeah, okay. it, it could, it, honestly, it's like I'm, progression in the metro. Yeah, it, it could, could reveal you, a lot of cool stuff. I'm going to be honest with you guys. Beyond just a place for the hot spring. Kopi yes. would immediately say do it. Um, <laughs> but I don't know if you guys are okay with that because this is a Above board, resource. totally okay with it. Yeah, I'm okay with it, personally. Okay. We can oh, also argue okay, in our do it. <laughs> If necessary, if anyone isn't okay with it. All right. What do you I mean? You're going to use two thirds of our money, Kirby? <laughs> above board. Yeah, above board. Love it. Love it. I love it. What love are you it. doing? <laughs> Too late. He's already doing it. <laughs> Stop that ghost. I'm, okay. I'm sorry, guys. No, no, it's fine. I, I want to see what's behind the boulder. Yeah, I'm curious. <laughs> Did you... Wait, is he going to kick it? <laughs> No, I think money solves this kind of problem. Oh, what is it going to do? Throw really it at him? Today. Well, how long is it going to take? Oh, it's going to take some time, I'm afraid. But I will make oh, sure. Why don't you hurry up? Can I pay 500 more for uh, expedited service? No, oh, she's I, I, spending all our money. No, a, a lot of it is yeah. the creation of uh, explosives, and it just takes a lot of time. Fine. Gopi, we she got like away. stuff to do anyway. Oh, How long uh, did you say it was going to take? I, I missed that. It's going to take time. <laughs> Insert session. Yeah. Time is a convoluted concept. Yeah. <clears throat> I um but your work your your uh your your work uh your workshop is available. The door is also unlocked, so you're free to come and go as you please in there. Ah, uh, everybody, our workshop is available. 
Well, oh, lead the way. Should I go use it? If, if it's our workshop, why is the only chair a perch halfway up the wall? Uh, what, what do you mean? I'm well, gonna I go just, touch all the tools. I, really I, think, I think, I think it just came like that, Tante. I don't think Let's you go. considered really anyone else using this. And it's quite yeah. selfish. I bet I could perch. Watch this. You could try, exactly. Olive's got the right idea. Come on, Tonto. Come and come and try. Where's These the perch? These grippers can curl. Right there. <laughs> I, wanna, uh, I sit on the perch. <laughs> you, you, you immediately snap the stick in half. Oh. Um. <laughs> oh. Gets up. <laughs> you sit there. I'm mending. Oh, it's messy. Oh, oh. Oh. I finally get in. One of us has to have mending, right? What was that? Oh, what? What did you just touch? I was just messing with these tools and he's like taking the wrenches and shit and like clanging them together. Do I see a broken stick? Uh, yeah, absolutely. What the hell, Remo? It's one day old. We we just got this room. I don't, what are you talking about? You've broken the, the, the stick, the centerpiece. What stick? The perch. Whoa. For, for all of us Somebody mammalian folk too. To sit on. I don't think Moth made it right. Maybe uh, Moth can reinforce it and make no. it stronger uh, now. <laughs> no, no. Let me. I'll do it, I guess. I'm going to cast mending on it. <laughs> After a minute maybe, of casting. Maybe you, know. you want to make it a bit, a bit sturdier this time. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Moth's cruddy worksmanship yeah. Yeah, well. it, it's definitely yeah moth and not the fact that you asked for a stick as a chair yeah, <laughs> yeah I, don't, I, I just think that if you're gonna I make a chair agree. i should be able to like sit on it is it mended right. uh, after a minute it is yeah Sorry, olive's yeah. gonna try to climb on it she like <laughs> flings see. her like waist over so she's like bent at the waist with like her head hanging over <laughs> uh you are alight enough to be on the branch Oh. You see? You all doubted me. Well, can, can I sit on it? Maybe not. I'm ne stuck maybe in the never. fireplace. <laughs> what? I'm Just... stuck in the fireplace. <laughs> I cannot move my character. Help me, token. step bro. I'm stuck Just in this furnace. Alive. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh, Moth's like, uh, is everything to your specifications? Uh, you'll you'll see yeah, moth. Yeah. You'll see moth has a tiny little work, uh, a, a tiny little like hard hat with a little light attached to it, and is holding a bunch of sticks of dynamite. Uh, yeah, I mean it's it's wonderful. Um, maybe we could make this the the perch a little bit more sturdy, and I guess applicable to people of different body sizes. I'd, I'd rather not just sit on a branch if I'm gonna be working in here. Oh, yeah, I could, I could go ahead and get a chair for well, you. I'm we sure could keep the perch here. and get a chair. Compromise. Is that in your hands, sir? Huh? Oh, me? That's the stick. Oh, yes. Uh, we saw this in a, in a, in a, in a, in a veil a long time ago. Uh, one that the, uh, uh, the Count uh, explored uh, some time ago. And from my understanding, it's called explosives. It uses a uh, it uses a material called uh, gunpowder, and I think we can actually gunpowder. use this to clear the. Um, I mean, gunpowder is a thing, you know. But yeah, it's like, mm -hmm. um, yeah, we could. I could probably use this to clear the rock. Moss, just... do not move. Harry's gonna hop okay. down and waddle towards him. <laughs> Hand me the device. Oh, I I'm afraid I can't. Uh, this is for uh, Madam Copy. I understand that, but you are standing dangerously close to an open flame. Oh! oh my God. <laughs> Does it have? Doesn't Moth have a flame inside of him? A little, yeah, isn't, a little, little. Isn't he oh an God. open flame? Yeah. I, 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 I think somebody should probably stop him. Follow that really Moth. Dangerous. So, are, are we gonna get a chair? Or? I don't, okay. I don't know. We put the order in. Okay. Let's go stop an explosion. No, but don't we need him to blow up the rock? Yeah, but uh, maybe not us too, and maybe I'm not sure himself. I'm sure he knows what he's doing. Yeah, you're just gonna he, freak him out. What gives you that impression of, of, of anything he's ever said? 
I mean, he made that whole workshop. I don't know. Yeah, that one's pretty cool. He, he just ran by holding dynamite. <laughs> so Everyone plug him? your ears. I think it's gonna be loud. But he's made of fire. He's going to light the dynamite. Mark puts down some sticks and continues to, to try and create more. Oh, God. And you know, that's, uh, yeah, he's like, this is going to take some time. Yeah, maybe we shouldn't like be here when it goes off. And I kind of oh. back away towards the fire. Oh, but your workshop is fully operational now if you want to go ahead and use it. Thank you, but I think there are more pressing matters. <laughs> oh, understood. Are you aware of the concept of OSHA violations? I'm uncertain with the ter I'm unfamiliar with this, the terminology. Right, Ocean well, violations. Something like that. I, I don't know what it's abbreviated from, but point is, you're not allowed to do stuff like that, Moth. It's dangerous. And why does the ocean determine that? I think the ocean is a, is a vast and powerful being, potentially, but <laughs> the important part here is that you don't die. Oh. Uh, okay. I'll make so sure maybe, not to die. Maybe put down the dynamite near the rock and stand back. Oh, I already did. It's it's over by the rock. I'm trying to create it, more now. Is it lit? Why? Why? Because <laughs> we need a lot to clear all the the, 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 the rubble over there. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Whatever it takes. Maybe we should go. Maybe we should yeah, go. Yeah, I'm not some sticking kind of around for when this blows up. Or yeah. we could work on stuff into fire. in the in the workshop. Um, moves. Or go. <laughs> Slides to fire so he can grab token. <laughs> I wish there were um. layers at Boundary. <laughs> damn you. All right, well, Moth, be careful and don't light it while you're too close. At least you give yourself a long fuse. Mm hmm. Good advice. Absolutely. I'll make sure to be careful. And if I blow up, that's okay. I'm sure the keep will bring me back. Yeah. Okay. That's the spirit. Yeah. All right. Are you all uh, leaving the keep now? Yes. Okay. Where are we going? What's up? Uh, heading. I think. Are we that... going back to like the dungeon area or so, not? The yeah. The... So we the were next. Kinda, we were kind of approaching a mournful queen, Benji. Yeah. Or yeah, yeah, something. yeah. 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 No, I know, yeah. but like specifically, what bonfire are we teleporting to? I meant oh. the one. Uh, yep. There, there's the yeah. uh, one in the mournful keep, uh, and there's one uh, in the garden uh, that is north of the right. town. Uh, you didn't, you did not uh, light a uh, fireplace in the town, so those are the only two that you have access to. Depending so the, the, the second one was like the do. cavern one. Yes, with the, the second one was it was the cavern the hot spring one with the yeah. hot springs. Yeah, yeah that's, that's the best okay. way to go about it. Yeah. Wait, I thought we lit the one by the hot springs and the one just past the NPC who gave us the Lord dump like last session. No, we, we did. We did. That, he said. Oh, that was th a camp. I think you guys made a campfire for that one. That one. I don't think you actually lit one for, I mm. believe. It, it's the cavern and the and the NPC. And, uh, the, and the mournful. So you have the, uh, mournful, the mournful one. Keep, yeah, that one. Uh, and then you have the one that's next to the cavern. That's kind okay, of in a yes. small little like hunting okay. lounge. Okay, well, I guess we're all ready and, and good to go. Yeah. So which one would you like to, to teleport to? Mournful keep. keep, I think. Okay, you guys mm -hmm. going to the Mournful Keep? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So be it. Uh, all right. Um, while I load this up. Could I look uh, up two things to have... How long would crafting in that room take, Brett? Um, it's you literally decide what two projects you'd like you, you what two um, items you'd like uh, to make kind of like your artifice or infusions okay so can I like role play I guess say that I, I spent uh, 30 minutes cooking something up this morning before yeah, we left absolutely. or something and absolutely. Uh, just like Give me a minute to figure out what it is while we yeah. do other stuff. Um, yeah. So what we'll do is actually uh, we'll take a small uh, we'll take a small break now. Let you guys stretch, get some water, go to the bathroom, et cetera, et cetera, and then we'll be back okay. in a in a couple minutes. Sound good with you guys? Sounds okay. Good. Yep. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. I'll see you guys in a in a minute. Hello, Ionians. 
We wouldn't have Niobers without our Patreon, so I wanted to let you know what we have to offer. By joining our Patreon, you're doing more than just supporting the streamed campaigns of IO. You're also supporting a brand new tabletop startup with IO Publishing and getting great value because of it. Join gives you immediate access to MP3s of previous sessions, premier access to content featured on the IOverse, including tokens for your virtual tabletops, and early access to music created exclusively for the IOverse. But also, you get access to professionally made 5e content, custom encounters, mechanics, subclasses, and more, available in professionally made digital PDFs for use in your own 5e systems, including the world's greatest role-playing game. Before you decide, why not give it a try? We have free content available, including a map of the Shattered Planet of Io, and immediate access to our custom Rackling race, along with four Rackling lineages, all with beautifully crafted, professionally made art. What are you waiting for? Sign up today at patreon.com slash world of Io, or type exclamation mark Patreon in the chat right now to get a link. Thank you to everyone who has supported the Patreon. We'll be right back.
I was, I, ah, I was saying, now we're back. Now we're back. Yes. Hi. Hello. I was mute. Smiley face. Hey. Hey, what's up? Are we back? Yeah, we're back. Yeah. We're back. Yeah. Yeah, we're back. Yeah. We yeah. teleport yeah. through the portal in the flames. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Your token should be linked to your player, so yes, there it is. Epic. Yeehaw. Wait. Hold up. Yeah. There it is. It, 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 it floated very slowly on the player view. Cool. All right. You guys, can I share a PSA that I of learned course. recently? Sure. sure. Yes. Okay. If you if you happen to have gotten COVID and two to three months later your hair starts falling out, don't be alarmed. It's apparently like a common symptom. What the like, fuck? It's called effluvium telogen or something like that. Telogen like, effluvium. Like the Galaxy will be yeah, okay yeah, yeah. on that front. Um, <laughs> I've already lost my hair. It doesn't matter. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah telogen effluvium is like, a generic condition. Yeah, and you can get it from other stuff too. Like if you get a viral infection or you get like a really bad <sighs> fever or something. Oh, wow. But like, so I started... Oh, oh sorry, go ahead. Go on. No, 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 go on, go on, sorry. Oh, just, just I thought I'd tell people because it's really scary if suddenly it starts happening and you're like, what, what's going on? Yeah. And then, yeah. yeah, but apparently it's really common and I've talked to like a ton of people who had that happen. It's usually about two to three months after and it'll all grow back again. But yeah, so don't be alarmed if it happens. So what you're trying to <laughs> tell me is that I'm going to get all my hair back? <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> Yeah, it just goes full loop, full loop. So yeah. twist the tape. Oh, shit. Well, you know what? I, I gotta yeah, start to buying some styling stuff. gel. Oh. Howie, great news. You come out of that campfire, and then this turret that you left behind just explodes. Oh, oh, I don't oh care. God. I'll make a new one. Um, I get one free anyway at the start of each rest, so I'm going to make the. Uh, oh, no. come back anyway. to life. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna make the protector turret right next to me. Mm, let me see. Uh, oh, also, one second. I have to close a program. There it is. Yes. We'll also close this. By the way, that workshop I literally made right when we were talking about that it. Was I was sick. like, oh, hell yeah. yeah. I was like, oh, good job. That was quick. I was like, give me a description. <laughs> I was like, okay, there it is. <laughs> Throw oh, a stick. Are we level four, by the way, Brett. 
Still you are level Yeah, four. we haven't leveled up. Okay. Your fifth level is soon approaching. Pending. It's going to be big. <laughs> it's going to be yeah. epic. Fifth is huge for Octopuses. I mean, it's huge for everyone. Fifth level is... Uh, Don't we get the new uh, new feats you were talking and, about? And yeah, at fifth level, you're going to get an, uh, a first level feat. You need new feet after what you did. Uh, yeah, stuff okay. your toes so bad. <laughs> what are you talking about? Uh, okay, I recovered. <laughs> All right. So, Eldritch Cannon, yes. Arty. Arty online. Weep, 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 weep. I love when he does the boops. <laughs> Simmer down now, Arty. That, no, okay, stop, stop. <laughs> I think he's malfunctioning. And then the no, he's just, he's really into dubstep. And then the Windows 95 <laughs> sound effect plays. <laughs> da, 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 da. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, um, all right, we were planning Kopi, to go up here into the ring. Kopi, as you walk over, this zombie just bumps into you rudely and continues to walk. Rudely. Um, and, Kopi, excuse me, what do you think you're doing? Oh. <sighs> keeps walking. I don't mind them. They're uh, they're not too bad. A little slow in the head, though. I. Uh. Oh shit! Oh, oh yeah, and a long rest has been completed, so I have to make mm -hmm. a, I have to make a fate roll to see if there are any respawns. Oh, you're good. Uh, the the uh, stairs behind you still empty. All right. There's uh more birds. Scrap! That's or what was it? Was make. it? Scree! 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 Cool. Thank you. Good call. Oh, I thought you said good call. Never mind. Uh, no. So, no, no, decent no, no. call. Yeah. So, what are you? Uh, what are you doing? Well, um, uh, is Tontu's armor magical? I'm now checking on Tontu's yes. armor. Uh, yes, it's living armor. So if, if Brett classifies that as magical, mm -hmm. then. But if not, I, then no. I do not count it as magical. So no. Then oh, no. wonderful. Oh my um, god. Well, <laughs> dude, did oh, Olive just ride? Olive rode forever! <laughs> Olive rode by a motorcycle, dude. That's crazy. <laughs> Whoa, is that magical? Oh my god. <laughs> Mr. Um, Howie, no, look no. at me! Uh, uh, here I go! Badass! Uh, Bad to the bone! Uh, Howie would, I think, infuse um, Tontu's armor. He'll just tink it with his hammer or whatever during the trip or in the morning or overnight. I don't know. Um, with the mind sharpener so that he can... I'll just link it to, to you. Yeah, so you're making it a plus one uh, armor, correct? Oh no no! I'm I'm just adding mind sharpener to it so he can uh, he can force succeed concentration saving throws. Oh, I uh, know. Sorry, constitution. Oh, yep, 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 yep. Uh, it's a powerful one. I got so you got four. Um, so essentially, you have four charges, um, uh, Tantu, where if right. you would fail a concentration check, you could be like, I don't fail. It's like legendary resistance for concentration checks. Yeah. Oh, cool. Yeah. Um, that's done. Uh, what, what's it called again? And I'll just uh, mind sharpener. Mind sharpener. Is that like a temporary thing? Uh, yes. It lasts okay. until I, I get rid of it. This is my one, Brett, from my uh, personal stuff. Yes. Yeah. So you can keep that infusion until I decide to take it away from you. Whoa. Nice. He giveth me. <laughs> also, that felt threatening. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> right for I so. Right for so. Take it away from you. You. I'm Better My second in personal friend. infusion is a bag of holding, and the two from the things we talked about before: wand of magic detection and the arcane focus. Okay, perfect. Uh, which one's holding the wand of? Uh... Mm, where you are? Oh, the wand. Um, who wants a wand? <laughs> How he actually says that? <laughs> <laughs> I'll take it. What to do? I I grant you the title of wizard. Here you go. Whoa. Uh, so bag of, bag of holding. I actually want to make sure that this all this shit's in your inventory. I uh, appreciate that. I'll link you what this does, Bree. Oh, thank you. you. You doing a wand of secrets? Did you say no thank you? No, 
No, I, 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 heard, I, said, I heard oh, that too. I said, whoa, whoa, whoa. oh, thank you. Sorry. I, I was like, was just like, no, thank you. I don't no, want thank it. You. No, thank you. No, thank yeah. you. No, thank I'm you. Good. <laughs> I know how to read. Thank you very much. I don't thank need you, you telling Benji. me what it does. <laughs> so you, you have that I'm for as long charges. as you need it. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Detect magic spot. Okay. You want to see well, that, that one's 24 hours. Yeah. No, d magic detection. Uh, magic detection. My bad. That's good. That's good. Give me a second here. Yeah. Might be a redneck. Uh, so you, you see magic within... Wonder magic detection? You see it within 30 feet of you. Okay. Uh, for it 10 has, minutes? It has yeah. been granted to you, Olive. Wonderful. Oh, it lasts 10 minutes? Yeah, you can walk around with it oh, for 10 minutes. Oh, that's actually really good. Stuff, yeah. yeah. Should I cast it now? Uh, I don't entirely know how it works, so use your own intuition. Up. She's going to cast it. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! What? Uh, so you, oh, you, one d three. Okay. Yeah. So you. Oh, you yeah. yeah. So you uh, cast detect magic. Yes. Wonderful. All right. Um, for the duration, sense of uh, presence of magic within thirty feet of you. If you sense magic in this way, you can use your action to, to see a faint aura around any visible creatures or objects in the area that bears magic, and you learn its school of magic, if any. The spell can penetrate most barriers, but if it's blocked by one foot of stone, one inch of common metal, or a thin, of, of, uh, a thin sheet of lead, or three uh, three feet uh, or of wood or dirt. Okay. You can spend one charge to cast tech magic, so like a little echo location uh Perfect. checking uh, does she detect magic yeah, do i detect anything she ma -ma 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 magic i mean she detects <laughs> necromancy from the uh the undead roaming around i detect stinky from them she points so for 10 minutes <laughs> Um, you will, uh, yeah, you'll just, I'll let you know if you detect any other, uh, magic that's perfect. Yeah, we should probably skadoodle then yeah, if yeah, we have yeah. 10 minutes. Well, you could use all three charges. It's yeah, I have three charges. Yeah. Wow. All right, lead the way, Olive, our torch bearer. Whoa, I never got to be a leader before. I, I stop all of them immediately. Wait! <laughs> Grab it by, like, the collar, and I point huh? up. Do you not see the birds? Oh, my eyes magic. are half open all the time. And they're not magic, like how he said. <laughs> oh my god, I beeped out of my mouth. <laughs> <laughs> That's such interesting role. I play. don't know what's happening to me. <laughs> I'm dying. transforming into a car. <laughs> <laughs> like an anamorph. Oh, oh gosh. <laughs> um, Remo, you'll, you'll have to be the vanguard, but we do need Olive up front to see any magical things coming. Well, I'm not I'm going needed. first. I got, what do you expect me to do? Oh, so that wasn't a stand back. I've got this. That was more of a stand no, back. A, it's scary. A, hold up. Let's think about this. We could distract them. Where's mm, Cubie? Just, just shoot these birds out of the sky. How about these? these? Birds? Oh, I, shit. What? Shoot? <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Sorry. It's okay. Uh, how about That's these? Fun. What if we oh try to God. reason with them? Why don't you... Eric, DM, DM me the lines, dude. Uh, come on. Uh, Why don't you... Uh, there's something in my throat right now. Why don't you uh, latch onto my body, and then I'll take the front. Let's go. Like a piggyback? Uh, I, oh, yeah, like a backpack. Yeah, like a piggyback. <laughs> Olive cannot reach her shoulders. You'll have to get down, Kofi. She's not that long. I'll be giving long? piggyback rides, but... <laughs> Tonti will interlock his fingers and uh, help Olive climb. Oh, uh, hell yeah. Teamwork. All right. Uh, yeah, Olive will wrap her. It was not fast <laughs> enough to RP the, the bending down. Sorry. <laughs> <You're fine. laughs> She'll wrap her arms around uh, Kobe's neck. Okay, let's go, bitches. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right. Wait, so, I resent that. <laughs> so while Olive is on your back, you will only be able to move at half speed. <laughs> The good news is, uh, Olive won't have to move uh, at all because you're literally piggybacking her and carrying her around. Uh, but she your falls speed, asleep. But your speed oh. is dropped at half while you are while uh, Olive is riding your back. So, uh, how much does Olive weigh? 
Well, it's um, not so much not how much, much Olive weighs. It's the 121 <laughs> pounds of goods that are on her. Which, by the <laughs> yeah. way, all, all, of you, all of you are now over encumbered, by the what way. What are you carrying? Oh, hold on. Hold on. Let me look at my inventory. You just took up, like, rocks? Like, what? Wait, where it's the motorcycle, see? for sure. Oh, it's, oh, it's a scale mill, which doesn't fit my RP at all. I yeah. don't need that. <laughs> Toss it out into the chasm below. <laughs> yeah, that's the heaviest thing. Give it to Artie, me. actually. Correct. Are you getting rid of the no. scale bale? No, I guess it changes my armor class, doesn't it? It absolutely yeah. does. Yeah. I'm wearing it under my cute God, when little we dress. She was dense. I didn't think we, we just need it. to. Oh wait, Olive. Yeah. I have a bag of holding. Oh, yeah. Uh, Olive, oh. you should probably offload some of that into this ginormous chasm, <laughs> but in this bag. Okay. Uh. I have 10 pounds of rope on me. Gonna put that in the bag. <laughs> My bedroll is seven pounds. I'll put that in the bag. Okay. okay. 10 pounds of torches? Bitch, what the Why fuck? Why do you have so many torches? You never know when you need a light, Mr. Howie, okay? I put do them you in smoke? the bag. Wait, why are my rations 20 pounds? Is that normal? Yeah. You, no, it's okay. not. You just have a lot of food on yeah, you right is. now. Yeah, it is. Okay. It's two pounds of ration. Yeah. Uh, oh, I know. Don't worry. I'm not. Can I put... now, now I'm like eyeballing my weight, and I'm still like pretty <laughs> underweight. Can I put the rations in the bag too? Yes, I'm you can. Kind of all, all my bag. bag. So that my should be minus bag. two, three. Oh, Yo, I got uh, darts. I didn't even know. Why am I carrying ball bearings? <laughs> the, uh, this is not. Um, the, this it's is a not rogue thing. You can roll them on the floor, and then people slip on them. Mm -hmm. oh. Yeah, you can like create, create uh, hazardous terrain or whatever it's Where called. Where do I see my like total weight? At uh, the bottom at, of it. At the bottom of it, you're you're currently uh, under encumbered. Oh, I see. 104 out of 120. I have a bell. <laughs> I'm definitely over encumbered too, Brett. So can I chuck one of no, these? Uh, no, you're not. They're, they're they're part of the sure. bag of holding. So it's. Dude, I, how I'm are you guys so heavy? I've had, oh, I've no. had, sorry, I'm not I'm talking about that. I'm talking about my own weight. 180. Actually. Yeah, I'm you're, 120 out of 240. <laughs> your um, so your your bag of holding. I'm heavily is, armored though. Is can, can hold 500 pounds worth of stuff. Yes, so uh, but, but my personal weight on my when I go to my inventory page is 136.8. Yeah, no, it's, it's fine. I ha I I I'm uh, I've made a mental note of that until I'm able to actually change okay. your encumbrance manually, which. I oh no rush, no so, rush. Yeah. I could just say I chucked the crossbows and all the rope. Oh and yeah, shit yeah. I assume there. you're 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 you do in full use with the, uh, the bag of holding. Yeah, yeah actually. Do you guys' like weight of things add up to the the bar at the bottom? Because mine says yeah. one twenty six out of one twenty, but it I only. You're over encumbered. But I don't have. But I don't have that much weight at all. I have like one pound, ten pound, two point five, two three uh, five. And you've two. got twenty two rations because of all the food you kept stealing. So now you uh, have forty four uh, pounds. It's you in the Skyrim <laughs> cheese wield. How do I, I pick see... up everything in the game? <laughs> How do I see all of that? The food that I have. The inventory? weight in your inventory? It'd say like a stack of 22. It'll be like consumable rations. I've got rations we'll one day and then I have eight and then two pounds of ration. Is this on the um, if you forge click C? or? Uh -huh. yeah. yeah, on, on right. forge. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, when I, when encumbered, sheet. a character isn't capable of maneuvering out familiarly and their movement speed is reduced by 10. Oh, I can't find it. Inv inventory. Inventory, and then you just should have a big it list of It should be under consumables. Inventory. Uh, under inventory. Anyways, uh, all you have to know is, yeah, you have 44 pounds of food currently. So, right. Excuse me, 54 pounds of food. Oh, oh my God. God. You have so many rations. <laughs> That'll <laughs> yeah. do it. Yeah, you have 22. You have literally like a have squirrel or something. On you. Yeah, exactly. Oh, I see. Okay, I'm here now. Yeah. I better start eating. <laughs> uh, <laughs> that's one. Six. That's one solution. Can I eat Your like six out. pounds, six point seven pounds of food? Uh, it, now? <laughs> that'll take you ten turns. <laughs> that, that, that'll take Probably. you a very take long, long time. Ten turns. That'll take you like <laughs> fucking a hundred. That's turns. You're, you're literally. So how many uh, pounds of food did you want to eat? Ten pounds of food. Six point seven. <laughs> okay. Just so, toss it in the bag of holding. With yeah, she, yeah, yeah. She, can Howie notice that she's about to eat six point seven pounds of food and say, just, "Just pull it out, like me, put it in the bag." <laughs> yeah, just just so you know, six point seven pounds of food is three days of food that you're literally just get about to like consume right now. Oh. So. Okay, I'll put it in the bag of holding then. 
Yeah, All right, that's you do. probably for the best. You do, and now you are under encumbered. Um, just so you know, when you're over encumbered, your uh, movement speed is reduced by 10. Uh, if you get heavily encumbered, which means you go uh, 10 beyond your 10 times your strength score, um, you will uh, get 20 speed movement redu reduction. And all ability checks, attack rolls, and saving throws that use strength dexterity constitution is made at a disadvantage. So, yeah. Good stuff, good stuff, good stuff. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, okay. Took a bite of the turkey leg before I threw it in the bag of holding. <laughs> nice. Just so I'd be full. Okay. And then I think that's, uh, I think that's it. Everyone else is good. We got some loot gremlins. Oh, yeah. Oh, but this always happens to me. Above board, eagles, they only attacked me before when I, I went to their level. We might be able to slip under them somehow. That would be nice. Let's try to do what, that. Just walk? No, yeah. but we could do something. We could hold something up. I don't know. We could, oh, we could grab that rug over there and hold it over us. <laughs> mm -hmm. I like it. Let's try it. <laughs> Good work. Are you are you going to grab the, 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 the rug and put it over you? I don't know if anyone else is game, but I think I'd you like should to try do. something. <laughs> Just how we so nice. Could I summon like a spectral or the hand, the mage hand, to cover us? <laughs> it's is it uh, a the big size hand? of a hand. It's, it's not a, it's it's also not a spectral, big right? Hand. It's translucent. Yeah. It, you, oh, yeah. that's right. It's a giant foam glove, like a baseball. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I'll never know. <laughs> this is it. You just like, you. no one sees the hand, and you're just All like, right. I am here. Let it is. Let's go. We just gonna walk mean, it and stuff. We, I think it is a good idea to try not to engage them first, maybe if they don't notice us, because uh, they might just think well, we're shambling just oh. As oh. you step onto the stairs, the eagles get, begin get, to get. swoop we down tried. on you. Uh, yeah, well, it was all off because we rolled a twenty, a twenty-four, a twenty-three, and a twenty-one. Yeah, yeah on our initiative. Roll? See, sometimes you, the DM rolls nice. well. Yeah, good job, oh, we had oh, multiple sorry. initiative crits. Well, we yeah. like the system when it works for us, Brett. Yeah. <laughs> well, what how would I get? Anything special happen for Tantu and I because we got crits, or that's only in battle? That's only in battle. Oh, okay. But great question. Uh, while you guys begin to engage, uh, you will watch uh, what is pretty much looks like an arachnid of various body parts as this huge oh, lumbering undead oh. will begin to patrol oh, fuck. around here. Arachnid of body parts. It's terrifying. I'm thinking the scion from Elden Ring. Uh, that's a good way to, to compare it. Um, it. It looks like this amalgamation of mixture of corpses Limbs. that are trying to just drag itself around. Ugh. As you just kind of hear the slap of flesh uh, slapping across the stone ground, just <laughs> as it just begins to scurry around. All right, Remo. Okay. Um. Well, the plan of somebody else going first kind of goes out the window when I'm the first guy. I'm going to 5, 10, 15. Oh, there's another eagle. 20, 25, uh, 30, 35. And I'm going to... Uh, okay, I have a question. If I ready an attack, do I get my whole like monk flurry bullshit? Or is it just one punch and that's my like counter? Uh, you get, you, so, whatever you would get with that attack action. Okay. Then I ready an attack if a bird gets within range. Right. So if you have, like, extra attack, you can, you can do the attacks. Yeah, okay. The only punched part is you can't do, like, flurry of blows and stuff like that, because that's okay. the action. Okay. Gotcha, gotcha. Yeah. All right. QB. E okay. Sorry. I there it is. Yes. Oh. Um, I'm going to move here. And have we not like started the battle yet? We're just trying to still get by, or oh, I mean, they're they're they're, they're diving down they're towards swooping, you. Yeah, yeah they're uh -oh. they've just played aggressive. No blows have been exchanged, but okay, okay, I'll I'll shoot the short. Oof. Okay. Ooh, ooh, still good damage though, which makes me my heart hurt. Miss. Is that good damage to you? Compared, yeah, I've... compared to what I do, even on a good roll, yeah. 
<sighs> yeah, the guy that does like 2d10 with by yeah. throwing a fucking rock. Also, yeah, the guy yeah, your damage sucks, dude. I can only do that three times move. per long yeah. damage is really bad, but I can do that three times everybody. per long rest. You can punch three times per turn, Greg, for more damage. Yeah, but I gotta work for it. Oh, bite me. <laughs> uh, so does that doesn't hit does it correct it did not hit Swing okay uh i'll bonus action i'll attempt to use cloaked wings and roll for stealth i guess yeah let's see it yeah. mm. and i oh. am done wow stealth sound <laughs> yes uh, Tonti will rush up alongside Remo and uh, take the dodge action. Nice. Iconic. Yeah, Owie. he raises his shield and he gets low. This feels very Lord of the Ringsy right now. He <laughs> um, Oh, uh, can I... How do I get Artie off me? Okay, here we go. <laughs> Five. Get off me. Evil shit. Fifteen. Uh, can we... Half... I, sorry, I know it passes a bunch of times. Can Howie move on your turn? Artie? Uh, Artie? Or Artie, uh, can so Artie move? With sorry, my yeah. bonus action, I can command him to move 15 feet and then activate or activate gotcha. four or I one of them. I keep mixing that up with the uh, Steel Defender, which literally right. goes at the end of your round. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, Howie will move here. I wish I could get more of you, but we're just out of range. So, Howie will move there and, take, and activate Artie after it's 15. Um... And that would be uh, Artie, not Remo and Tontu, but everyone else is, and including Artie gets, uh, gets his, what? Uh, temporary HP. Uh, so not, not us, but not you guys. You yeah, I can't uh, reach okay. you. Too. It's ten feet. All right. Sorry, I'm just clicking on the thing trying to find it. There we go. Ooh. Oh, thank you, thank you. Yeah, one, two, eight plus five. That was a Ooh. fucking good roll too. I uh, well, I would love that. Okay, um, yes, mm -hmm. and I think I'm just going to cantrip because I want to save my spells a lot. So I'm just going to cantrip on this eagle and blast it with a, a f uh, firebolt. Ooh, that misses. Oh, Doesn't, shit. You've got the uh, arcane focus, right? Is that, that, that should all? be added already. That right is there? already added. Uh, oh, wait, no, hold on. Uh, plus, plus five. Uh, oh, it wasn't added. Oh. But I equipped it. But I equipped it. Why was but it? But it was equipped in the engine. Oh, you know what? I think you're not attuned to it yet, which is probably why it wasn't uh, attunement required. Ah, uh, uh, yes. Uh, you are attuned. Okay. Uh, why? Thank so you. So I will. I'm just gonna reroll again, but it does hit. I'm gonna add plus one to that, uh, just to make sure that it is still not added, motherfucker. Okay. Anyways, don't worry about it. What we'll the add, fuck? We'll keep an eye out. Your intelligence is. Yeah, it should be adding it. Oh well. Uh, so yeah. Roll 12. yeah, so 12 does hit uh, Dealey. Oh, 10, really? 10 points of damage. Um, okay, and then I'm going to see the rest of my movement and just flap over around the corner. That's my turn. Okay. Uh, the eagle has landed. Let me just go no. <laughs> Did you say no? Yeah, it's clearly still flying. Okay. Yeah, this is what it'll do. Oh. As it breathes uh, cold, well, I tough. will also I also need a uh, Remo, not Remo, uh, Tantu to roll dexterity save. Dexterity save? At advantage because you are dodging. Um, Boom. 16, 16 is sufficient. 12 is not. Man, Dex is like my thing. <laughs> Dude, I'm so good at Dex. What the fuck? Why am I rolling a five? All right. So that'll be uh, nine points of damage. Cold damage. Olive. Um, okay. I'll sacred flame this one. Okay. Ciao. Come on! Oh, yay! yay! Let's go! Nice. And that will end my turn. 100% hit rate this session. <laughs> Hope yeah. It's coming together. Okay. Um. 
He's gonna run here and then dash command to run here. Okay. I believe that ends around. Let's see Aren't you giving uh, Olive a piggyback? Yeah, but I can't move Olive, so. Oh. Okay. And you're moving half speed, correct? Yeah, because. Yep. That's right. why I dashed. Cool, cool. That's it. Okay. I can't do anything else. Uh, this one's gonna dive down uh, and attempt attack to attack action at Olive. Oh, yeah, let's see it. Uh, That'll hit eight points of damage. Uh, what is this? One, and then also uh, one, one, one second. Um, what is the second attack? Uh, I believe it's my martial art. Let me look or whatever, like the class ability. I think that's uh, as a bonus action. You can attack with your offhand. Is it? Let yes. me look. Um, and then ah, uh, oh, fuck you, right? Uh, since I have Sentinel, I'm gonna Sentinel attack uh the bird Let's instead go. of before Olive. Okay. Do I do I use my deadly relic spear? Uh, yes. For this you one. Will. Yes. Okay. You I'll get destroyed. And then, uh, yeah, you stab through the eagle, and it just dives down into the uh, earth below. Uh, no attack mate. Get fucked. Okay, I'm going to go go back to muting. Uh, Remo, bird uh, will... Uh, actually, we're going to go right here. Uh, I need. Oh, oh come on! I need sorry. Remo and Olive to roll uh, dexterity saves. Dude, what? I have, to, okay. I have to do something. I'm sorry. Oh, not yaddy, yaddy, yaddy. Okay, Yeah, fine. you did <laughs> it. Uh, okay. No fair. So, Olive took my luck. Uh, so the eagle will uh, gain an inspiration from your downfall, but Olive, you can grant inspiration to someone. What would you like to do? Who would you like to grant inspiration to? I'll grant inspiration to Kopi for the yeah, piggyback ride. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> inspiration granted. Does the frost breath count as an attack, Brett? Uh, why are you asking? Oh, for your like in interception. Hmm. Hmm. Let me actually tell you. When uh, you get when a creature you can see uh, hits a target other than you within five feet of you with an attack, it, this does not count as an attack because it's a saving throw. Okay. So, good to uh, know though. I use a combat recovery. Fuck you. That shit hurts. <laughs> Ow. Cool. Uh, okay, so you'll only take five points of damage instead of seven. All right. As the eagles begin to surround you, Remo, it's your turn. Okay, uh, I'm going to punch. Okay, uh, that'll hit. Then I am going to start my flurry of blows with a punch. Okay. And a heal on myself. Ooh. Uh, uh, 10, so flurry of blows to... is 10, and then you attack again, correct? No. Oh, so, you can replace hand of healing to uh, heal yeah, yourself. One... One flurry of blows is a hand of healing on oh, myself. Oh, that's right. That's right. Uh, give me a check. Oh. That'll be five hit points healed. Nice. Cool. Does that end your round? Yep. Uh, QB. Okay. Um, I'm going to, uh, short bow. Okay. Or, yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. Oh, uh, this I will can't be that, at advantage. Oh, I already rolled it. Um, Five points of damage, and you get to sneak attack. Okay, sneak attack. Is she what's attacking up? this one, Brett? Yeah, I'm assuming. Yeah, okay. I'm assuming that's what she was doing. Mm. Okay. Oh, sorry, I got confused about the range rolls. I, I thought she was in melee range, but that's Artie. Nope, she is not. My bad. Okay, um, I, I'm trying to figure out if I should... Attempt to go over... No, that would put me in real. Okay, I guess I'll just stay here? Oh no, I'll, I'll bonus action uh, attempt to hide again. Okay. I thought I had you. <laughs> yeah. Alright. <laughs> Are you moving at all or no? Uh, no. 
All right, Tantu. Um, Tantu will. How how high up is this guy? Uh, it is in melee range. Tantu will jump in the air and swing his warhammer. Let's go. Yeah. Whoa. Twenty-two for twelve uh, the, bludgeoning. The bird gives a solid a slam on the stairs before it plummets down below. Ow. Fantastic. That hurt. Does that end your round? Uh, he'll turn to face the other eagle. Eager Scree! for the battle to come. Scree! Howie. Um, okay day. Beep, 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 boop. Um, I will do my usual. A yep. firebolt on this creature. 14, I guess. Let us go. Uh, yes, that will hit for on nine this, points of damage. Um, why is that and any? Oh, well. I will reactivate Artie. Sorry if this okay. is annoying slash confusing. No, stop. Well, what are you- So uh, annoying and, confu and or confusing. Ooh. Well, I got you, you know what's not confusing? 13 free temp HP. Oh, oh, why'd you why why'd you roll like that? Oh, that's the same roll though, right? It is, but I just I have to do this manually. It uh, is, but because oh, the macro it. now no, he has to. It. No, it's fine. Uh, who are you targeting? I uh, just Tontu and Thingy with the new one. I'm pretty thingy. sure it doesn't it wait thingy. Like it from. I'm Who's thingy? thingy? Uh, to be fair, even when he knows your name, he says it wrong. It's it, <laughs> Ray Rebus. I don't know the thingy. name. Thingy Rom Romulus. Well, I'm not even like that guy. I'm a thing. <laughs> Wait, so, yes. so is it, sorry? Yeah, that, that's what I wanted to do, and obviously, if it can't apply to everyone else, it would do. But they already had that thirteen HP anyway. Yeah, so everyone's got thirteen. No one else has been hit. Uh, so cool. yes. Correct. All right, that's my turn. That's some good rolls right there. I tell you what. Uh, Tatu, get pecked. Oh, oh, what? That's what the hell? All right. Ow. Well, I didn't think that was going to hit, but here we go. That's... Bye, Temp Health. Bye, Temp That's Health. Nice, temp, nice knowing you. You still have one. <laughs> All right. You know what time it is. Oh. Sacred Lake! <gasps> Yo! Sacred Lake! <laughs> yeah. Wait, did it, oh, it worked? It 100 damage. One damage. One damage. One damage. One damage. One damage. 100% hit rate. <laughs> All of you Sorry killing it. Thank you. <laughs> You're owning it, Olive. <laughs> You're powerful. It's I so genuinely awful. feel like though Sacred Flame is the worst cantrip in the entire game. I, it's pretty it awful. Pretty dog shit. Yeah. It's I, I, I got uh, guiding. Clerics don't really get a choice though. That's a problem. Yeah. yeah. Uh, uh, good, um, good dodge, <laughs> Remo. Good no, dodge. I'm just. <laughs> um, <laughs> powerful dodge. Dodging great dodge. Sacred Flame. <gasps> He sees its power. I was trying to click on oh. the damage to see how much damage it could potentially roll, and I clicked on the save. So, oh. you know, if you were aiming at me, it wouldn't have hit. Just like Remo, Remo flinches. That's Remo flinching. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry. I'm so ready for it if it was coming at me. Kopi. There the bow. Let's take this eagle out. Yaddy, yaddy, yaddy. Take this spear out. God, what a fucking professional. Oh, oh my holy god, shit. Damn. Holy really good shit. One, the eagle explodes. Oh, god. Um, oh my god. Who would Dude, you like I wish I wasn't fucking sick so I could have like been like <laughs> That's good. Yeah, That's but good. But you did that even while sick. That was so good enough. Kind of <laughs> uh Kopi, who would you like to grant inspiration to from your glorious critical? Well, all Artie of looks gave up me... at you. <laughs> Ignore Fuck off, Artie. Artie. Ignores Artie and gives it to Olive because Olive gave it to Kopi. Yeah. That's right. Artie more like bit farty, of, am I right? A little bit of condensation appears on his front legs. Oh my god, the, is he crying the, and he pee himself? The eagle gets Arx's COVID. Great. Good stuff, chat. <laughs> oh my Shut god. Shut up. Oh my god, Shut the thing, fuck man. up. Fuck. Okay. Avian bird flu. As the, uh... <laughs> I gotta get out of here. <laughs> As the eagles dive to the abyss below, uh, you are now aware of a walking ab abomination, uh, undead in nature, patrolling the hallways as you continue to advance forward to the bonus Wait, so queen. The whole point of her 
on my back is because I we need to scout with the sensor thing, right? Yeah, correct. Okay. Um, so I guess I've already first. seen something. So. But we will find that out uh, on the next episode because we're gonna want. Oh, thank God. We're gonna round up to ten. You weren't I'm supposed dying, to say dude. that out loud, Eric. Oh my God! I'm and I tried my I'm best. It over. <laughs> I'm fucking dying. I'm sorry. No, no, I'm kidding. I'm fucking around. I just, I love the <sighs> idea. That's the first time a player ever said, "Oh, thank God for wrapping yeah, up the session." D &D yeah. Session. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, I, I, I tried to. I thought I'd be able to last dragging. longer, but yeah. I, I need to, I need to fucking go. I need to lie down. Go yes, lie down. please. Um, okay? go 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 go. I need to fucking go. Go go go. 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 Goodbye. 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 Thank you, Brett. No, uh, you're banned. You, everyone. You're banned. Go. Get out of no. here, kid. Get out of here. Get, get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Save yourself, <laughs> dirty animal. I go kick Alex from the call. I don't. I don't until, kick him. That'd be rude. Until next time. Okay. I'm not, I'm, 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 I'm gonna kick you out of the call, Eric. You better get the hell He's out gone. of here. He's too okay, polite. Good. You had to do his like proper goodbyes. Yeah. <laughs> proper goodbye after saying thank God. No, I'm kidding. I'm fucking around. <laughs> Uh, yeah, so we uh, will continue this session um, not next week, but the following week. Um, and uh, yeah, we'll also hold off on fan art for now just because it was a half session. Uh, and if people are down, um, I would like the 20th, September 20th, uh, to be a longer session for potential overtime. If you guys can make it work. If you can't, no worries. Uh, but I am open for a longer session. Uh yeah. Mm. And we'll uh we'll talk more about that once we get a little bit closer. Um otherwise we can still do a normal session, but I do have to go. Um but thank you guys so much uh and uh yeah, we'll I'll we'll see you guys in a couple uh couple weeks, yeah. Have a good. Okay. Right. Have a good Bye. one guys. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.